Hey people, this is the mercenary. I thought I might talk about this model kit I showed in a previous video. This, my friends, is the P Bandai Zeta Plus, the one that was shown in Gundam Unicorn. This particular Zeta Plus is based off of the source material for the development of the Zeta Gundam if you ever pay attention to what's really going on. As you can see, it's kind of a bland color or something associated with the C1 general release. The only difference between this version and the general version is this the general release version is is based off of Amaro's colors and this is more of what the regular force would go get when they were issued these type of suits. This suit was finally animated in Gundam Unicorn for which each of the units were destroyed by I, the Federation Tri-Stars. It comes with a shield. It comes with its regular Zeta Plus rifle. In addition to that, it comes with a Rizal rifle with extra ammo packs for which you cannot store anywhere. So unless you have a Rizal Commander type, there will be no place to store those extra ammo packs. And it also came with three different V-Fins, but I decided to use the transformable V-Fin. And thankfully, they did fix a problem off of the general release. The general release one had solid plastic v-fin this has a somewhat plastic i didn't mean plastic i meant rubber type material for its v-fin it came with a whole bunch of stickers since this is an older kit from 2001 with its source material colors so instead of using those stickers i decided to color it in with red sharpie as you can see this is supposed to be a yellow sticker but instead of using yellow sticker i use red sharpie There's supposed to be a sticker right here, but I also use Red Sharpie for that, as well as the thing that's supposed to be a bird motif. And I also colored in a bit of the chest component with Red Sharpie there. Now, what makes it slightly different from, from the regular release Zeta Plus is, is this extra wing parts where here, you can store the Rizal rifle onto. And it looks kind of neat. And also, you can still store the regular Zeta Plus rifle on its back as such. Now you can transform this thing into Wave Rider mode like make all the other Zeta kits but I'm not going to transform it because I like it the way it looks. Now about the hands. There are still the ones that were part of the regular issue so it's not going to be really good at holding its own weapons. Well, almost knocked it over. You could still get it to hold the weapon, but it's you're going to need a bit of trickery to keep it in the hands. See? You're practically using trickery just to keep it in the hands. As it's not quite secure. But more or less, still a good kit if you can get it under $60. I'd go for it. If you're not too interested in this 
color and parts variants of an older kit, I'd pass. But since I've always wanted a Zeta Plus based on the source material, it was well worth the $55 I spent just to go get this kit. This is the Mercenary, and I'll be signing out.